consists of three aspects. There is a new world political system that everyone today is calling the new world order. As well as that, there is a, an economic plan for the new world order. And that is called the new world economic order. Uh, in addition to those two items, there is a third plan for religion. You see, uh, the planners of the world know that men need a religion of some kind, even if it's a false one. So they have a plan to give us a new age world global occultic religion. So really, there's, there's three aspects to this new world order. A new world economic order in which a computer chip will be injected into our hands or foreheads as a means to track, control, and identify us, and will also be used to uh, make our purchases and scan. And well, they've, they've already put the program in in Los Angeles. In fact, uh, right. a trilateralist uh, named Mayor Bradley, Uncle Tom Bradley, was uh, responsible for putting this in dogs. Right. And your children will be uh, considered like animals, like animals. And well, yeah, operating through the Council on Foreign right. Relations, through the Trilateral right. Commission, through the Club of Rome, through Global 2000, which right. wants to reduce the population of the planet by, uh, what is it, uh, 25 percent. 25, that's two, uh, 1 billion, 250 million people have to be exterminated by the year 2000. Ain't no microchips! It's June! An office in Sweden is taking wearable technology to the next level by implanting microchips into their staff. Yes, that's right. The newly opened Epicenter office complex in Stockholm is offering workers the chance to be chipped under the skin of their hands. The radio frequency identification chip, which is about the size of a grain of rice, allows users to open doors, swap contact details and use the photocopier. Uh, it felt pretty scary, but at the same time it feel, felt very modern, very 2015. The chipping is entirely voluntary and according to manufacturers, it's completely safe. So some of the future areas of use, I think, like anything where you today would use a pin code or, 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 a, or a key or a card. So payments is, I think, one area. Uh, I think also for healthcare reasons that you can sort of uh, uh, communicate with your doctor and, and you can get data on what you eat and, and, and sort of what your uh, physical status. Uh, you have your own identification code and you're sending that to something else which you have to grant access to. So there's no one else that can sort of follow you on your uh, ID, so to say. It's you who decide who gets access to that ID. Ain't no microchips! It's you! This is Zoe. Just like you, she uses lots of different cards and IDs to get through her day. What if all Zoe needed was herself? Introducing Amazon One, a free service that lets you use your palm to quickly pay for things, gain access, earn rewards, and more. Let's say you're grabbing your favorite coffee beverage or heading into the office or checking out. Just hover your palm and you're on your way. It's as easy as that. Sign up is free and takes less than a minute. All you need is a credit card, your phone number and your palm. That's it. Since your palm is unique and can't be lost or misplaced, you can get things done quickly and securely. And with more experiences on the way, Amazon One will help you get even more done simply by being you. Now, Zoe has more time to do what she loves, indoor skydiving. Enter, identify, and pay with Amazon One. ¿Qué onda, gente? Ya tenía rato queriendo grabar este video. Ya tenía rato sin subir videos sobre los chips que tengo implantados en mi mano, ya que muchos me preguntan los usos que le doy. Y pues para que vean cómo es mi día a día con los chips y cómo los utilizo, la practicidad que tiene el hecho de tener implantado un chip, hoy les voy a mostrar dos ejemplos de los dos que les doy. Principalmente este que es de pagar con terminales de este tipo, que son para pagos sin contacto. De esta manera pago eso que se ilumina es el chip que tengo implantado y es el que me permite hacer pagos por medio de terminal. Y el otro que prácticamente es mi favorito. Mi favorito es poder accesar a mi negocio solo leyendo el chip de esta mano.
RFID, NFC microchip, RFID, digital NFC business card. The future is upon us. A digital business card. Scan the hand. And there we are. Always have a business card. decided to implant an RFID chip in my left hand. I figure, if my cat has an RFID tag, why can't I get one? So I implanted a chip, about the size of a grain of rice, in my hand. And now I can read and write to it using an RFID tool. I use an RFID keycard at work and decided to clone my keycard onto my hand. <laughs>